us with RCR Wireless News and I'm here with Lars Johnson of Broadcom. Thanks for joining us. Thank you very much, Martha. Good afternoon. I think you're going to show us some of the LTE innovations that you've got combined here. Yes, correct. So uh, at the CES show here, we are showing our LTE technology platform. We have developed a number of complementary technologies to further enhance our product offering that we will announce later this year. Um, some of those you can see on the screen and I can walk you through the highlights. Great. So we have um, shown here um, the size benefits that Broadcom will be able to bring. There is a teardown of the iPhone 5 and it shows in blue the area of the current LTE modem in the iPhone 5 and we are overlaying the area that a Broadcom LTE solution with a similar spectrum support would require and it's about one-third smaller. So, so uh, roughly the dimensions would be roughly um, so, yeah, no, it's not hard to say, but we haven't announced the product yet. So, um, we, we'll explain this when we when we announce in more detail what level of integration we have been able to achieve. But a 30% reduction in size is very substantial advantage, and OEMs in smartphones are always pressed for size. So that is one benefit we bring. We have a number of other key benefits. Um, it's fairly technical, but there's a t solution called envelope tracking. Envelope tracking is a technology um, developed to improve the power consumption during the uplink transmission from the device into the network. And in LTE, your signal continuously changes, goes up and down, and your power transmit requirements change with your signal. So typically, a power amplifier would emit power at a constant level. But in order to optimize this in line with the requirements of the transmission, we can track the envelope of the transmission and adjust the supply voltage of the PA in real time such that we can save up to 40% of the transmit power in an LTE modem. Another one of the key technologies that you see in LTE networks coming up this year and next from the likes of Verizon and AT&T is voice over LTE. Voice over LTE is required for the service providers to continue the LTE rollouts and be able to use some of the existing 3G spectrum. And the reason that they need an LTE, a voice solution on the LTE networks is because to free up 3G spectrum, they need to find a way to support the current voice business that they have. And voice over LTE is the solution for that. Voice over LTE has a number of benefits um, that it brings in addition to allowing the migration of the spectrum. If you, if you look at this chart, voice over LTE is also spectrally more efficient than 3G voice. The reason for that is that LTE is an OFDMA-based packet-switched system compared to 3G, which is a circuit-switched system using CDMA spreading sequences. It's very technical, but in that technology lies significant differences on how to transmit data and voice is just another form of data. So it's spectrally more efficient and then uh, as we bring out voice over LTE, we can also do this at lower power than you can do in 3G. So we project that the power savings of a voice over LTE call compared to a 3G call is around 40% less power consumed in the device. <clears throat> the last benefit of uh, Volti is that it can support high quality calls. It is much more flexible in supporting different codecs and you can sample wider bandwidth of the voice and have a more natural sound and get higher quality. And this is a demonstration we have here live at the show where we use a Broadcom technology platform connected to an LTE network emulator that is configured to represent Verizon 700 megahertz LTE network 10 megahertz FDD. So the Broadcom LTE solution is connected. We have an IMS server that does the call control in the system and we use an industry standard test equipment to send pre-recorded voice signals to and from the telephone. And then we compare those to the original signal and then you get something that is called the MOS score and the MOS score we see here is right now 3.8 and it goes around 4. 3.8 to 4 it goes up and down depending on channel conditions. In comparison to the 3G system 
the MOS score for a very good 3G call is only 3.5. So Volti has a number of benefits. It allows migration of voice calls and spectrum from 3G to 4G. It is more power efficient and it comes at higher quality. All very exciting. And the reason we show this demo here is as it exemplifies the readiness of our LTE technology and our ability to support the most advanced carrier requirements for LTE. All right. Lars Johnson, Broadcom. Thank you.